Oh, all right. Uh, weed blowers are going today again, so they always are. <laughs> Place has never heard of a fucking broom. All right, we have some uh, kind of breaking news in the environmental uh, department as far as greenhouse gases go. Uh, we have something really bad happening. We have a spike in methane. For the last two years, scientists say that we've been experiencing a terrible methane explosion, a extreme methane plumes all over the world. We know where some of it came from was the leak in California, obviously. In the 2000s, methane was rising year to year about 0.5 parts per billion. But in the last two years, that has been spiking to 10 parts per billion. Now, methane is worrisome because it's 28 times as strong a greenhouse gas as CO2. Yeah, it gets out of the uh, air faster, but half of it turns into CO2, so it's a terrible gas. We don't want it in the atmosphere, but it is spiking quickly. Uh, where is it coming from? Well, we have this fascination with eating meat here in the U.S. and other parts of the world now, and uh, cattle raising has increased and increased and increased, and you know that uh, cows have a ton of methane. Also, some of it is so some of that uh, feedback loop that we've talked about for years. Some of it's coming out of the ground, both in the northern and the southern hemispheres, on the land masses, and also it's coming out of the ocean in the shallower part where it can escape into the atmosphere. But wherever it's coming from, we're seeing huge spike plumes of CH4, methane, and it is going to have terrible repercussions on this planet in the future. Now this was not expected, so this wasn't included in the climate models. So the climate models now have to be redone to find out just how terrible things are really going to get. And of course, with the uh, right wing firmly in the seat here in the U.S. and in the U.K., that information will probably be suppressed from the public for years and years if we ever see it at all. And if we do see something, it'll probably be some kind of, uh, well, you know, fake news, <laughs> the real thing. All right, let's go find out what CO2 is doing here in the atmosphere of the planet Earth. As you can see, it's going up and up, continuing from last year. But look how high it was last year. Look at the rate in which it is climbing, people. This is so important. Ignore the people that are telling you that there's nothing wrong with it. Just ignore those people. They're lazy and they don't want to change anything. One of the ways we could change getting rid of uh, methane is stop eating meat. Turn into a vegetarian. Eat fish. Something other than chicken or bird fowl. And what was that? Oh, damn. Eh. Oh, well. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I often get shit on. Hang on a minute. I gotta clean this off. There's so few of them, but they always seem to find the top of my head. Here in the Pink Barrio, we're actually learning of an oil spill of a 176,000 gallon pipeline that ruptured just 150 miles away from, you know where, the Dakota Access Pipeline protests. That pretty much tells you that the pipeline protest is a valid protest these pipes do explode. I certainly appreciate all the people up there in the Dakota Access area and in the district who have been protesting this last weekend in the cold blizzards against these pipelines. You people are a hero of the U.S. and the world. Now there's one other thing I wanted to uh, cover today on this video was I keep getting comments about my video and why it doesn't get more subscribers and uh, maybe the keywords aren't correct or the this isn't correct or the descriptions aren't correct well I think there's two issues here one is that the topic is boring as hell not too many people hardly at all have an interest in it maybe 0.05 percent of the whole population of the world uh, my subscribers have been pretty low all along they're now to something and the view count has never changed. So 
I sort of think that the subscriber thing doesn't really correlate to anything. It um, kind of is a worthless thing here on YouTube, like their comments section. I, I wanted to put up the, uh, a comment on the uh, video here, but the comment is now gone from me seeing it. It, it. it says that there's six comments or ten comments or something, and you look at it and there may be only five or six comments, and all the others have been somehow gotten rid of. So I don't, and, and then I stopped commenting on the comment section to see if that would help, and that sort of helped, but now we're back to, it's back to being really bad again, so I don't know. I think that should do it for today. But I certainly do appreciate the comments that I do get. Um, I think most people get to see most of the comments. I don't know when they start disappearing or if they don't appear in the first place. And I, I do get the ones out of spam and all that. So go ahead and just have at it and put all kinds of comments on there. And I certainly appreciate the ups and the downs and the new subscribers. And until next time.